Hey guys, Britt McBricksworth here and welcome to the video. Now this one is going to be a ma mighty of videos because some of you are going to hate what I've got to say and some of you are going to love what i got to say. But let's get into it. Guys, remember, if you like this video, please leave a like and do that subscribe and hit that notification bell because it really helps the channel. Anyway, let's get into it. So today we are looking at the Avatar Lego sets that have been announced for January 2023 release. So let's get right into it. We're looking at the Illu Discovery set number 75575 and straight off the bat, what the friggin' hell is that? Not a clue. Looks like some sort of undersea snake slug slash dolphin fan thing. I have no idea. No idea what they're going for there. Uh, we'll go deeper into minifigures um, later, I think. Well, no, let's go into them now. What the? Flippity Chibber is going on with the heads on these Avatar ones. They're a bit long. They've got noses, which looks just wrong on a minifigure. And it's got friggin' ears. I mean, yeah, right. It looks like an avatar thing. I suppose. No, it doesn't. It's <laughs> the laughable. Laughable. If anybody likes them, then go ahead and say in the comments below, I like these. <laughs> you go ahead. Right, the next one. We're looking for the skimwing adventure. It's swimming and it's flying and it's a skimwing. Uh, again, moulded headpiece on the actual thing. The worm butterfly crap thing, what it is. I don't know. Um, it looks rushed. The wings on it look rushed. It, no, don't appeal. Does not appeal to me whatsoever. Again, minifigures look crap. Them extra long freaking legs look crap on a minifigure. I know what they're going for. I get it. They don't look good on a minifigure. Changed my mind. Next, we've got the Mako submarine. 75577. The submarine looks pretty good. I'm not going to lie. The submarine looks pretty good. I like the um, rock built things you get with it. Uh, they look good. The little stingray type thing. That looks good. Minifigures, again, look great. Next, we have the Metakayina Reef Home. Well, however you freaking say it, I don't know. Whatever. 75578. It looks like, kind of like a like a friend set sort of thing, I suppose. I don't know. I, don't, I mean, what they're going for is like an underwater sort of look. So you've got one part of it looks like it's underwater. One part of it looks like above water. Looks unfinished. Um, Not going to lie. Again, minifigures look crap. And I think we're on the last one now. Yes. We're on the last one. So you've you've endured to the end of the video. I know it wasn't long, but well, you haven't yet. Let's get on with this bit. So we've got what looks like a blue whale with finnies on its face. Um I said finnies there, don't even think I said anything different. Right, so we've got a finny whale face, uh, which looks like it's got stickers above the uh, below the moldy pieces where you just think, why didn't you just do full molded um prints? I don't know. Anyway. That little crab thing as well that comes with it. That's pretty good. I like that. I think it's good. Uh, the blue whale thing looks all right. Eh. It's ish. Average-ish at best. Um, I'm not a fan. Not a fan of well, any of them. Apart from that um, earlier on, the Mako submarine. That one looks all right as a submarine. I'd probably get it and jettison the minifigures somewhere. Like against a wall or out of space. I don't know. Throw them across the road, run over them with a car. I don't know, something. Just to make it a bit more fun. Uh, guys, you've actually now endured to the end of the video and uh, I hope some of you enjoyed it and I hope some of you hated it because I think it's funny that way. Um, please comment below either way and um, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.